down bowl. When they have these bowls on sale, what they do is they let you play it online. Play it on, whenever I played it online, Chloe came really close, so we'll see if Chloe, our cat, comes real close. And as you know, we are integrative medicine doctors, which means we did allopathic training in regular medical school, but we also study things like sound therapy. So we just got one in the mail. And hopefully this is it. I have, it doesn't say Ulm store or anything on it. Wouldn't that be funny if I opened it up as like cheese or something like that from Amazon? Okay, so we got the scissors for bowls and they're all handcrafted out of brass. And so it's not as big as I thought it would be. This is the large size. Our bodies are meant to be in, kind of our cells like to be disharmonious. Where we have harmony, like we're made to sing in harmony. In choir, we have alto, soprano, tenor, and bass. Well, that is kind of creating a melody. We're confined to that kind of pattern. So it's better to sing with oh, mm. That kind of dissonance is extremely healing for our bodies. Our cells like that dis dissonance. So these vibrations or sounds are not meant to be harmonious. We're getting a little bit closer to the beginning. This is going to be the striking, I don't know what they call it, but this strikes the brass bowl. Oh my gosh, it's beautiful. I forget which bowl I got. Oh, this is the sunset bowl. Just because it spoke to me, I thought this, the sound was just absolutely beautiful. And it has a little tiny thing to set your bowl on. This is how the sunset bowl looks. And these are each handcrafted. It's really beautiful. And this is the pad to set your bowl on. They're mindfulness, mindfulness products handmade. How to play your singing bowl. Hold the singing bowl in the palm of your left hand. For a smaller bowl, seven inches, I hold the bowl with your fingertips. So hold the bowl in the palm of your hand. Grasp one side of the mallet with all fingertips pointing downwards toward the other side of the mallet. Gently tap the mallet against the side of the bowl to warm up the bell. Slowly run the mat mallet over the outside edge of the rim bowl with constant even pressure. Use a full arm movement, just like stirring a big kettle of soup, and keep the mallet straight up and down. It's not in the wrist. Here we go. Pretty. Go to grab my crystal singing bowl and I'll show you the difference between the crystal and this brass. I love the brass. This is the crystal singing bowl. I can't remember if this crystal was meant to be the heart or the root chakra, but one of the two. And I'll let you hear the difference. See how much louder that is. This one aside, let's go ahead and do our brass one. We had a 
sound therapist that would put the bowls right on the areas of the body that were hurting and so that the dissonant sounds would cause the cells in the body to be in disarray and then go back to where they should be. But hers were all complete, 100% crystals, different types, very, very expensive bowls. Her bowls ranged between $1,200 or $1,500, and they were absolutely beautiful, different colors, but different qualities. But they all have certain personalities, so you treat them with a lot of care. So those are our two singing bowls. And thank you for sharing the different experiences with me, and I will see you again in my next video.